now back to the Gulf Coast. We're less than a week away from the first large Mardi Gras parade in Mobile County. And here in the Port City, there's one store already breaking sales records for throws and more. Speaking of throws, WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones, you're right there. I've got a surprise for you, Jeremy. You went out to two me's. Here's a toss. I think you're ready for this season. Oh, I got them all up one. <laughs> I mean, that's a pretty good catch. I'm sure you'll make more throws, but you said that place was slammed today over at Toomey's. Yeah, Dana, it was completely packed. I mean, people were having their shopping carts filled up to the top with beads just like these. And the store owner tells me he's surprised that so many people were already out this early in the season. Mobilians swarm Toomey's Mardi Gras headquarters. Preparing for parades this year. I ride for Neptune Starters, and my husband is a marshal in the organization, and we have to stock our flight. We are riding the KOER organization over in Fairhope. We ride on February 11th, so we're over here loading up, getting ready. Stephen Toomey is no stranger to the Mardi Gras season. He says keeping this store is a full year round effort. We prepare right after the last season. You know, we start ordering merchandise and it's been an awesome year thus far. I, what are we, 14, 15 days into it? And it's it's crazy. I mean, I've, I think people are more ready than ever to celebrate again. With more demand, Toomey says they've already hit record-breaking sales. We had a line wrapped all the way out the back warehouse wow. door. <laughs> but uh, it's settled down some now. And uh, yesterday was a record day for a Saturday. And it's just... Uh, Hopefully we can keep up and just roll right into the carnival season. And the shoppers keep rolling up, showing us their big buys. Point me through your cart and just show me, you know, what you what you got today. Um, the guys on the horses love to give out flowers, so we have those. Our little daisies. Um, the kids love anything that lights up, so we have lots of light up stuff amongst this buggy. And of course, chocolate moon pies, that's a given. Oh, we got plenty of beads, plenty of uh, throws and moon pies and glow sticks, frisbees, cups, light up sticks, <laughs> clappers, football, so. the, the typical throw. You just saw a lot of people buying a lot of throws, but don't worry. Toomey tells me his store has enough stock for the whole season. Find a list of parades on our website at WKRG.com. Reporting in studio, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.